When you look at what's happening now, the rate of rise is dramatically different. And the number of states and the number of counties in the United States that have what we, what we consider a red zone because of their characteristics is now well over half of the country. So this is faster, it's broader, and what worries me, it could be longer. And I think it's on all of us right now to make sure that it's not longer. I'm making the personal sacrifices not to infect my parents and my pregnant daughter. And there's a lot of people out there who know how to protect one another. And we just need to make sure we're all doing that. Well, if bars and restaurants are open, then I can have 20 people over for Thanksgiving. And so I don't like it to be any number. I like it to be keep it to your immediate household. Because, you know, if you say it can be 10, and it's eight people from four different families, then that probably is not the same degree of safe as 10 people from your immediate household. Dr. Deborah Burks traveled with family out of state over Thanksgiving weekend. The White House Coronavirus Response Coordinator was joined by three different generations of family at one of her vacation properties on Fenwick Island in Delaware on November 27th, just one day after the Thanksgiving holiday. She defended the trip, saying that she needed to take care of winterizing the property before a potential sale. I did not go to Delaware for the purpose of celebrating Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving, Burke said in a statement. 